morning routine, Mythic Bells. Got six of the kitties up here. Usually today, that's the six that come up here. Two sleep with me at night. Most of the time, that would be a little rock gold. She's a golden right there. And then Nugget. She's down there on the floor. When I wake up, I open the door and Tiny Bear's little family, not so little, that would be Gypsy Rose and Kalahari. And here's Tiny Bear. You should see my lap here. They're sleeping right up against the door. I don't think they sleep there all night, but maybe they do. All three of them all piled up against the door. They all come trooping in, get on the bed, come up nuzzling me. Usually the two kids, Kalahari and Gypsy Rose, get to me as absolutely as close as they can. Of course, Mom always gets the best spot right here in my lap. She'll sit here in my lap until I go numb or get up. Is that right? Yeah. And Simbicon, he's not usually in the pile right outside the door, but he's never far away, and he's always right behind him. Two kitties that never come up are Sequoia and Sahara. And I think that the, just the sheer numbers of the kitties tend to intimidate them so they don't come up in the morning. First thing in the morning I start out by grooming the kitties that I can reach without getting up. And once I'm fully awake, I'll get up and move around the bed and groom the rest of them. Get everybody brushed out. Pretty good. Depending on how the time factor is going and how patient they are. Okay, guys, are we ready? Here we go. <laughs> it's breakfast time. Yeah, not that you guys care. You guys just want a few treats and then you can walk away from a full plate of food and just waste it, huh? Okay. All right. Let's get the morning going here. Oh, look who's waiting. Simba Khan uh, went outside. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Look at it here. Okay, yes, it's almost breakfast time. We're getting ready to go here. All right. We're getting the shades up and we're going to get everybody fit. Everybody's getting their goodies. Keep them occupied while I get some food ready. What do you guys say to that? Yeah. Quick Koi already gulps down to two goodies. Okay, the kids are being awfully patient with me this morning. I've heard a couple of them say at least once or twice already, we should put down that silly camera and get us some food. Okay, there are two trees out here. We usually put out two different kinds of food. Morning, I really try to keep it to quantity down because it takes them all morning to eat it. Sometimes they don't even eat all of it because they eat so much in the evening. This is the rabbit, home, home prepared rabbit. I got the water running over there um, because it takes forever for it to get warm. They'll eat it cold, and it will be cold anyway, but I. Always add uh, water to their food. It helps keep it fresh. Um, and also, you just can't give them too much water. It's possible to give them too much water. And then this is the commercial red cat. As you can see, it's almost frozen. Start. I start just scraping it out of the out of the tub. It's still half frozen. Okay. Now we can spread it out here on the tray. Trees. I put it out on two trays in the morning just so that there's less uh, less kitty squabbles over the food. And they all want to eat at the same time. Okay, let's put a little nice warm water over top of it here. The 
as long as it stays moist, it'll be fresh for hours. Sometimes they'll scarf it all right up, and I'll add more, but usually they take a few nibbles and waddle off. They've, they've had their goodies after all. It's all they want, and they eat a lot in the evening. Okay, what's the matter there for, uh, for uh, Kalahari? <laughs> he, he looked at the food and shrugged. He'll come back later. Simba Khan was outside peering through the window, so he didn't get his goodie. We'll give him a goodie. Don't worry, some kind you'll get your goodie. There's Sahara. And she goes right for the rad cat. Rad cat is really quite quite popular. For some reason, uh, they don't like feline's pride that much. And it should they should like it. It's a very similar formula. But it seems like uphill work to get them to eat it. So I'm gonna save the rest of that next batch of kittens. And here we go, we've got Mother and daughter, tiny bear, Gypsy Rose, eating in here.